I may have found the key to making any dropshipping store work instantly. Shh. Now there's been a pattern with dropshipping that seems to work just about every time I do it. And after a few years of repeating this process, I no longer think it's a coincidence. Now there are two main keys to becoming successful with dropshipping instantly. It's crazy, right? Just two. And the crazier thing is that you don't even need to have the best product to make it work. If these two things are on par, I can almost promise you that you will become successful. So watch this entire video because they both need to actually work. But it's easier said than done though. So let's start with the first thing. This is one of the most important things that I have noticed makes people purchase when they go on your website. Now let me ask you a question. When an ad catches your eye, maybe because it got some bullies in it or I don't know what, I don't know what it is. When an ad catches your eyes, what is one of the first things you look at and look for when you go on that website? Actually, before you even click on the website, I can almost guarantee you that you read the comments to see what other people are saying about that product. So one thing I was able to see people do live on my website using a heat map is people would scroll down to check for reviews to see what other people are saying about the product. But the problem is that you guys are lazy. Yeah, you with your hand on your meat getting ready to beat your meat after watching this video because you're not gonna take action yeah you the problem is that you're lazy because I get a lot of websites from you guys asking me to review it and almost just about every single website like this is not a joke at all almost just about every single website has less than 20 reviews on it now if you simply just quit being lazy and add over 100 reviews to your store I can promise you that that alone will change people's thoughts about purchasing on your website they'll feel more comfortable and are actually more likely to buy from your website and that's literally a proven fact especially when you see a lot of people adding to your website and checking out and just not buying a lot of you guys also ask me like why do I have all these people adding to cart but they're not buying it's simple they just don't trust you and trust your website so just like when you see a post on Instagram with just 10 likes and scroll by without liking it even though you think the post is cool because it has 10 likes you're not gonna like it right but then when you see the same post or post very similar similar with a hundred thousand likes you're gonna double tap that motherfucker like seriously it's not your fault it's just how the human brain works we seek any sort of validation from other human beings so a simple trick to make people's brains release those feel-good chemicals when they're on your website to spend so that, so that they can go ahead and spend money you know what I'm saying is simply add in hundreds of reviews or thousands of reviews using looks now I've used looks to add reviews on my website since I started dropshipping back in 2017 ish 18 so that's what I personally recommend it's simple to install like you literally would just drag it to your bookmark bar after you install it and then go on Aliexpress and find multiple suppliers selling your product and import those reviews using looks directly from Aliexpress now one thing I personally love is that you can literally sort by photos only which is extremely important and key to making people buy from your website because when they see just a text review I mean they don't believe that because anyone one can write the review people want to see other humans are receiving the product and actually love the product you get what I'm saying so you should always add reviews with photos that is a non-negotiable and then because you're importing reviews from Aliexpress some of the grammar will be off so when you're going through the reviews don't scroll fast read the reviews to make sure the grammar makes sense and if it doesn't looks literally allows you to uncheck the text and upload just the photo which is literally perfect in my opinion it's crazy click the link in the description and pin comment to try looks out for 14 days free now the next thing that'll make your dropshipping store most likely work instantly is the video you'll use to run your ads to get people to then go to your website this is so important so keep watching this is easily the hardest piece of the puzzle and that's why getting this perfect every time is almost impossible because the style of videos people are willing to watch changes over time by the time you've perfected this model guess what it's changed so regardless of the changes that will happen how do you always make a good video that people are willing to watch all the way through well the key to making Facebook TikTok, Instagram Pinterest show your ads to more people and more people that are willing to actually buy and give you money is getting people to watch your video at least 70% through and when I tell you this is extremely hard to do oh boy trust me it took me 
me years to even be good enough to say that this works all the time for me when I make my videos. So now let me explain to you my strategy for getting people to watch my videos at least 70% through when I'm running an ad. First thing is I make sure it is no longer than 30 seconds. The shorter your video is and can educate people on the product without any dead space or extra BS in the video, the better. Now this is because people want bite-sized content these days. Especially if you're running ads on social media. They're on social media to literally see something and keep scrolling right away. No one is gonna sit there on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, and Pinterest and literally sit there and watch something for a, a minute, you know what I mean? That's what YouTube is for. Not Facebook, TikTok, Instagram, Pinterest, Snapchat, and all these platforms. These platforms are now literally flooded with bite-sized content, so the consumer now is used to that and only wants that bite-sized content. Personally, my ads are around 15 seconds. So first thing first, don't make it longer than 30 seconds. Now the next thing is, to make a video, you're going to need a crazy hook right away. Right in the beginning of your video, you need a crazy hook, kind of like this video. I said, I found, you know, what makes dropshipping work instantly. You're gonna wanna know what it is and how to do it, right? So you wanna say something polarizing, you know, make a bold statement. Or I will say something actually scary that's going to scare them into watching because they want to know more because they're scared that if they don't watch the whole video, they're not gonna be able to solve that issue or they might lose money, whatever it is. If you scare them, they're going to watch more. So after you hook them in the middle of the video, you then want to give them a solution to that problem. If it's not a problem solving product, then show something and explain something that justifies that bold statement that you just made. Hook in the beginning, justify in the middle, and then a quick call to action in the end. Stop being lazy, add those reviews using looks like I do, and then master the art of making a good video, and then your dropshipping store should literally work overnight. Allegedly. <laughs> Peace. Get out of here.